Hello guys, Zuljin here. Welcome back to another episode of Kingdom. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Last playthrough, kind of, <laughs> kind of disappointing, right? Got you guys way off until the end, and it looks like I kind of failed towards the end because I, I really went too far. I think I'm going to try to concentrate my assault to the first at least 40 or 50 days and not go past there. I'm going to try my best to get as much archers as I can, just like I did last game, and not expand too far out uh, until I'm very ready. I want to rush knights. Uh, so that I can attack as early as possible and uh, but when I'm ready I think my first assault with Knights is going to be on day 16 that's gonna be after the blood moon of day 15 and that is going to be prime time to assault a portal uh, so I'm hoping that I can get Knights and everything online by that time I'm gonna go a little bit and explore here and try to drop a couple of gold for these villagers uh, let's see what's past here. Just in case there's a chest of gold. There is a chest of gold. That is wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Okay, let's get that. We don't know if our Mason's Tower is out here, so we should probably just continue to go. Yes, it is. Um, I'm not quite ready to make that expenditure yet. And it looks like... Man, this is going to be a really, really, really quick start. <laughs> I hope he brings bows. Usually his first delivery is bows. Let's see if there's any buff statues out here. There is, and that is the worker statue. That is not the archer statue. So being as far out as I am, I really doubt that there is the other buff. It would have to be on the other side of the portal, and I'm not quite ready to check that out. Uh, but a builder's buff would be nice, but then again, we don't have the money. Tomorrow, we'll go out to the right and see if we can find the statue before the portals. If there is a statue on either side, it would make sense if we could, um, I guess, use both buffs and kind of attack both sides at once. Well, not really at once, but balance it out. But I think focusing on one side above the other, if we have both statues on one side, is a good thing. Kind of like I did last playthrough. Just not quite as exaggerated. I think I, I waited too long to pull the trigger last playthrough, so we'll see. But if all, as always, guys, if you do enjoy the videos, make sure to give me some dap on that like button to show you support for the series. And you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos, guys. I'm going to keep on playing Kingdom. This will be the only episode of Kingdom today. Not to say that I won't do double uploads anymore in the future, but I do need to get uh, some streaming done today. And yesterday, the footage that I usually would use um, kind of got messed up. Well, it was a short playthrough, and I waited too late to, <laughs> to play. I tried something very, very aggressive, and uh, which was like fighting on day 11. And it did not work out in my favor, unfortunately. So it looks like I chased these deer back for nothing. Well, not nothing, but... Um, yeah, actually nothing. <laughs> um, but it's nighttime, and they won't attack while that's happening. All right. Uh, night, day three, I can use, uh, builder's hammers, so I'll probably do that. Um, we can probably go out with very, there's very, very little to worry about the first couple days. I mean, very little to worry about. Uh, like this guy. That was the, that was the brunt of the assault. Um, actually, let's go with him to this encampment. Where are my people? Where's the people at? There's no people right here. Ah, oh, they were hiding. Yeah, you guys take some, uh... There's the portal. That's actually inactive right now. And there is... I doubt I can get these guys across, but I will try. And I'm trying to see if there's the buff statue on this side. And that would kind of determine what our strategy is going to be like, you know? Day two. Still plenty of time. And another gold chest for acceleration. Quite, quite the find, <laughs> if I do say so myself. That'll be enough for tools. I'm hoping that merchant that I hired a second ago drops me some bows. That would be nice. And second portal. So, it looks like, I don't know where the, the Dorn uh, Archer's statue is, guys. I have no idea. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. <laughs> only one only one greed to worry about. Not that bad. I guess the people may have triggered the uh the portal. I'm not sure how that works actually. 
make sure I have all my stamina to get across. And I'm hoping that my people can... Uh, you guys come a little bit further down. Dang it. <laughs> Go away. I want these people. All right. Maybe... No, 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 no. Come, come back. Maybe that one greed will pop out the portal, grab the, uh, the gold, and go back. Yes, he did. Okay. <laughs> Hard dang work getting these villages across. It's usually not a real good idea to try to recruit across a portal. I mean, it's usually not going to end up in your favor, but... We did get a couple people, and... The money's not that important because time is money as well, and sooner or later we'll have unlimited resources with farms and everything else. Alright, so it looks like this guy did not drop any of the tools for uh, hammers. Good, he bought bows. <laughs> That's exactly what we needed. Alright, it's day... It's approaching night. I could probably hire one builder. There we go. And let's go ahead and build up to the next layer here and we don't really need walls still probably don't need walls we'll need them tomorrow night though and we need to be ready for the blood moon so I suppose that's something to consider as well there you go <laughs> take my gold and get out of here that was from the same aggro that uh, was from last time let's grab one more you stay away from my people I'm gonna bait you guys I'm gonna bait and bait and bait until I can't bait anymore. And hopefully, that will help us. All right, some more bows. And that should fill all the rolls here. I'm gonna have to go left to recruit again, I think. Because <laughs> we don't even have a builder yet. Let's see. And I could still bait, too. I'm not worried about it. Still not worried about it. Let's get to that left town. Is that going to be the brunt of the assault? I think it will. I think it will. If that's the case, that's awesome. <laughs> We're going to get a really early start right now. All right. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. Come on, dear. Turn back. I want a couple more recruits before I go. And I should probably invest in this while I'm here now. It will not hurt. I don't need a builder to come out or anything and do that, so it'll be all right. Day three. I think we're doing really, really good for day three. Tons of recruits. They have plenty of time to get back. Plenty of time. Alright, now I could probably get across to these deer. Not that I can bring them all the way back, but it wouldn't hurt. I'm going to go ahead and buff my builders one time to... Actually, let's do twice. Because archers... From what I know, archers are really good to have buffed, right? They, they are extremely good to have buffed. But, in the beginning game... I think the archer's buff is only really good for offense. Like defense, we really don't need it. With the amount of people that we can have stationed in the castle, kind of mitigates the need for any kind of concentrated arrows, so to speak. Um, as far as the offensive strat, um, that's very important to have your, your archer's buff. So we'll make sure to keep that in mind as we play through. So I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. The, uh, the Kingdom series has been going on a little while. <laughs> Somebody commented the other day, uh, mini-series, like, you know, and with a smiley face, because at first I said that this was going to be a mini-series. Uh, although, in, in all honesty, I do think that we're approaching the, uh, the end. I think I've recorded enough episodes to where now when I beat it, I'll be happy about it, so. Right, sorry about that small interruption, guys. My deer are running away from me. <laughs> I had to, uh... My wife just walked in, so I had to, to talk with her for a second, but... Uh, so yeah, this deer it doesn't look like it's gonna stop, unfortunately. Oh well. How about you, guys? Y'all go over. Not that money is really, really, really super important right now, but 
having a nice acceleration for the deer is is super nice super nice to have there we go and now I should be able to run too yes that's good you guys hunt very very well I'm proud of you all right let's start uh, let's see we got our hammer position filled that's that right there let's go ahead and invest in a camp upgrade and more bows and now more recruiting <laughs> that's the name of the game uh, let's see where exactly are we gonna be able to find our first farm not this one naturally because that's over a village we could expand over the farm um, and make sure that the I guess you could say the villages are within the walls that's a good strategy as well uh, let's see, it is night three, so I still don't have to worry. The builder should have the first wall up, yep. And he's going to put the second wall up, and that's going to be good. In fact, by the time... No, I can't upgrade again. I was going to say, by the time he finishes that wall, we could have done an upgrade, but I think that's cutting it a little bit too close for comfort. One more builder would be nice for the next stage, um, I guess you could say, of recruiting. So we'll have two builders online. And that should be plenty good, to tell you the truth. All right. So we've got that guy that's going to go be a builder. And there is the knight's harassment, I guess you could say. Yeah, I know it cost us a gold, but that's okay. I wanted to get to these guys as soon as possible. I guess I could say that guy because there was only one. Let's go a little bit further. A couple more people. You guys head back. And he's going to go past the portal. Okay. <laughs> Very good. All right. So what's good about this is we're really, really, really taking advantage of the, uh, the recruiting aspect. So we'll be able to rush knights quickly. Very, very quickly. Um, now, we don't want to go too quick. I've done that before, and that usually doesn't work out in my favor. Uh, but as you can see, these builders buffs are pretty good. So we also want to make sure that we are capitalizing on the camp upgrade up until the point to where we get those free walls. And that'll accelerate the uh, the money situation a little bit further so we can um, we can continue to use money for recruiting instead of anything else. And it looks like we might have lost someone <laughs> through the night's battle. No big deal. You are still welcomed at Camp Zuljan. It's not quite the Zuljan Kingdom yet. Come on, catch your breath, horsey. I wish there was like random patches of grass out here, but it's all this mossy grass, <laughs> like you guys called it. That's not grass, Z, that's moist. That's. <laughs> I almost said moss. Moist. Moss hanging off of the ground. And you're right, it's just like mossy earth. All right, getting back across here, and if we can get these in before it's over with, I think I'll be happy with, now this is going to be workers definitely, and we will need workers for catapults, but that's about it, although it will save us some money, I think that's, I think that's going to be all right, I think that's going to be all right. Let's see if we can go any further to get one more set of recruits. I kind of lose track of what village is a witch. Think I've overstepped my bounds here. Yeah, that's portal country. Okay. So with that extra money, we'll continue the buff because we have almost a full stack, sack of gold. So the next few walls that will be built will be really good. And we shouldn't have to worry about that for now. Uh, it is approaching the nighttime as well. So as soon as I catch my breath here... I will be sprinting <laughs> to get back to town ASAP. Uh, but it's only night four, so it's still not Blood Moon night. Uh, so we still have a night to prepare. Uh, it would be nice to have the knights by the Blood Moon, but it's going to take away too many of the arches that we already have. So uh, waiting for the next night would be better. <laughs> I mean, waiting for the next, uh, the next Blood Moon would be better. Uh, knights for the Blood Moon are really good to have, but... Uh, day 16, I think, is going to be the day that we attack. Uh, pretty much the third blood moon, we're going to send out our first brigade of knights. And hopefully we can have that up on both sides 
to extend our uh, influence that way. Uh, we do need to do a little bit of expansion before that happens naturally. We need to get one wall out so that we can have the, um, uh, the what you call, we can have the flag out for the banners, you know. All right. A little bit too late for the deer chasing. That's one of my opportunities, I guess. Uh, let's see. We do have two workers, so I'm not really worried about those. Let's get some more bows in hand here. And that should be the majority of my recruits, if not all of them. And still a little bit of money to go. Very nice. Let's just go ahead and rush to the right again to get more recruits and eat some grass so we'll have that continued buff just until the moon passes and we know that it's safe. All right, let's do it. People are the name of the game. Swelling up the ranks so that we can win. Uh, I don't have any more verses. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> I'm not too good at singing this morning. It's early. That's probably why. All right. So that's three people really quickly. So that was easy. Some more rabbit money. Thank you. And let's look at expansion for the day after is what we're going to be looking for. Let's try to get one more rank. And this should be stone walls on both sides along with the first level of towers. Which... Avoiding towers altogether is not the best, <laughs> not the best method. It does work. Uh, we don't need towers now is basically what it amounts to. This guy's probably going to give me hammers. That's what I'm thinking. How about you come back and you come back and you come back. There we go. That's a good recruiting trip. I'm happy about that. Four people a day. If I concentrate on at least that number, using both sides, I think I should be fine. Um, and right after we have the Blood Moon, we'll consider expansion. I'm going to make sure that these walls are up to the first stone stage, not the second one, because that's a little bit overkill. And then we can worry about the first level of expansion, which is going to be uh, the outer walls past the first form on the left. Uh, and that's going to be like, think, aha, good. Uh, that's gonna be like right here, I believe. So we'll need to clear this tree and Clear this tree I think that's how that's gonna work and the first wall here. I Don't know where the first wall is gonna be. I got to clear out a couple things first Let's get on the side of these deer just to accelerate this a little bit more Will you guys turn around? It's almost night of the blood moon. I ain't got time to mess with y'all. I really don't I have to get back I'm hoping that my archers will just nail this guy. Oh no, can't take the time. A little bit too, a little bit too short-sighted for that. All right, and hopefully I'm gonna have the option to build here, because that's where my form is going to be. Right on the other side of the form would be perfect. Okay, he brought his bows again. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome, man. Uh, okay, well, there's the blood moon coming. I wonder... I wonder if I can get this one guy on this side of the portal before. Everybody's starting to walk in now, so... With the number of people that I have right now, guys, I really don't have to worry about... Um, I really, really don't have to worry about it. I should be fine build is coming out to improve the quality of that wall. See it start to sparkling. He's building it up here. Am I going to get... I might have to bait just a little bit to make sure they're across. Nope, they're going to make it across just fine. Which side is the Blood Moon coming from now? Left or right? Do you have plenty of arches on... <clears throat> excuse me, plenty of arches on both sides. And I even have two more. Join the fight! Yes, shoot! <laughs> he picked up the bow and started shooting. Yeah, this is gonna be so easy. Let's make sure I don't have anything coming from the left over here. That's perfect. Alright, let's go out and recruit. Go out and recruit. We'll stop on this first patch of grass. And 
We'll see where we can get past our form too. So we don't have anything coming tonight. Nothing to worry about. Uh, we'll go ahead and start this form up. And let's see here. Where is going to be the first mound? Like the first wall past the form. I think it's going to be here. So my workers are going to have to kind of come out here and clear a little bit of this out for me to be able to get to that wall. Because I want to I wanna put it behind the form. Actually, it would be nice if I could get both of them in there. Because uh, that would promise me unlimited money. That would be really, really good. But it's not necessary. Not necessary at all. Let's go ahead and drop a couple gold for these guys. I'm going to make it to the next camp and do the same thing. Then I'm going to head back towards the right. And we're going to keep this recruitment strategy going on. Recruit, 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 recruit. It's hard to say that a few times in a row when you try to. And I don't think we need the builder's buff for anything. No, and we still have like a day of it. So my next couple walls should be fortified as well that's what I hope hmm. morning coffee is making my stomach go crazy <clears throat> I don't know if you guys drink coffee but typically when you drink coffee in the morning and <laughs> before you have breakfast or with breakfast even before your stomach is settled with food it makes my stomach growl <laughs> like sometimes it's scary I'm like oh my god Oh my god, there's an alien in there. <laughs> it's really not an alien, but y'all know what I mean. Uh, okay, come on, dear. There's nine gold waiting. That will buy almost two sides for these two young... Oh no. No, turn back around. Turn back around. Turn around. Every now and then I kill a deer and I get some gold so I can win my kingdom. That's not a good song either. I think I've tried that twice this playthrough. That, those songs. <sighs> One day I'll learn that I'm not a singer. Oh, <laughs> caught you in the butt. Caught you in the butt too. That's wonderful. So good. No attacks tonight because the blood moon just passed. All right, let's get a second, second thing going here and bring my workers back out. And I need to put a wall. Let's see. My next form is here. I think, man, there's three forms. Wow. Uh, let's go ahead and clear out this tree and this tree as well. And we can get all of these suckers, man gonna be a little bit too far out I think we might need a second wall right here we do have some time to play with here we do I don't know why I'm chasing this deer right now because it's actually night and they're not gonna hunt for it anyway okay there's the worker I'll go ahead and let them come out here and let's see they're gonna come out and try to chop these trees which is gonna be good you know what, I could go while they're on their merry little way to do their business. I think I have time to jump back and do a short recruiting trip to the right. I think. And again, we want to make sure that we have nights for day... Um, oh, what day is it? Day 16, I said. Yeah, nights will have to be for on the blood moon, ready to go. And the expansion is going to have to go to here. So, that's something to consider. Can I, can I drive yet? Thanks. Okay, let's get two more builders. Okay, and I would like to have catapults for that night too. So, hopefully my builders haven't traveled too far away. Come on guys, come back, come back. This is where I want it, right? Oh, it still hasn't cleared yet? Oh, it's still disappearing as it goes, huh? Yep, still is. Very faintly. <laughs> Very faintly. We're gonna have to clear these out eventually, too. But it's not even letting me because it hasn't... Enough area hasn't cleared yet. You see how it's clearing as we go? It's just taking a little bit. I can go ahead and summon a former... I mean, a uh, builder back out here to start this now 
because that's far enough along. And there's the morning bell, so we should be clear until the next nightfall. Which the wave will be so small at that time, we can just bait them anyway. I know I'm wasting time here. Not wasting time, but using more time than I need to for what I need. Let's see if I can get some of these deer to turn back quickly. There we go. Three of them's fine. There we go. Run right past those people, guys. Come on, deer. Ah, uh, and you're not going to turn around, are you? Fine. You're not either? Come on, deer. <laughs> it's when I, I, I do the same thing every time, man. I recruit these people and they start walking around and, and that's what happens. Okay, now we can build the wall out. And we can also improve the farm. But I'm not going to yet because we don't even have sides to fill these rolls. Wall is going to be the most important thing. I'm going to use my money for that. And now we can set out... I think we can actually get rid of this 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 and this without endangering that camp and now I need a little bit of money um, actually I don't know if I need any more money to do this there we go so as soon as they clear those trees they'll upgrade that to a stone wall give me the gold man I want the gold and this will be the furthest that we have to go out for a while, you guys. I mean, a while. So, next, we have to turn some of these empty-handed workers into farmers. And I think, with a bunch of scythes, we ought to be able to do that relatively easy. There's the first patch of them. And now that they're all within the walls, it should be fine. I'm going to have to set up my archer tower on the left side there. Because I think archer towers kind of define where your um, where your archers kind of pile up at and build up at. Alright, so this should be very, very, very easy here. Let's go ahead and get some farm tools. And... One more should do it. There we go. And we shouldn't have to worry any more about that. Can we upgrade this? We sure can. That's going to start that process. Actually, another gold. And I can go recruit. I know we have plenty of empty-handed people. Not to worry, folks. Not to worry. Soon money will be no object. No object at all. Do you guys have any money? Nope. Alright. Oh no. <laughs> I just messed up. I messed up. Oh no, 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 no. Shoot him, guys. That was almost so bad. Where did they come from? Oh, wow. Well, I guess I got attacked on both sides. All right, I need a little bit of tax money. <laughs> I overspent, I overspent. All right, I gotta go rebuild that wall right quick. My builders are still kind of close, so this will be all right. Let's go get this wall rebuilt. And as soon as my wall is rebuilt, I'll feel much safer. Very good. That's my wall that's going to be rebuilt. Okay. Um, also, this needs to turn into a farm, and this as well, but I don't have quite enough money to do that yet. Alright. Another thing we need to do desperately is turn that, um, start that guard tower on the left. That way my arches gravitate towards there and don't, like, rally up at night. All right, good. I have a few bucks here. It's not forgetting about our recruiting. There we go. 
and we can also turn this one more time there we go and uh, I guess we can go ahead and invest right there too to get that first guard tower online there we go got our recruiting done for the day what day is it eight still got time good 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 all right so let's see if there's any money available knights and catapults man these farmers are gonna have to pull through tonight quick or today I guess I should say quick there's enough to create another farm here but I think it would be better if we were to turn this one into a real farm okay still need two gold for that Nothing that they shouldn't be able to pull off. I don't have any archer towers right here either on the back side of this. See, they're turning in for the night here because they don't have any other place to go. That's why I really need to turn that into uh, to something there. They don't really have enough gold to make it either. You guys kill anything? All right. I should be able to turn this into a um, farmhouse or a water mill now why did all my archers leave that wall line that's what I want to know is it because I don't have a tower there I guess so I guess it's because I don't have a tower there it's like they retreat back to that first tower and my builders are going out here to like repair that wall I think I'm gonna try to bait uh, they're gonna pick all of this up too. Let's try to do this. Maybe that'll save me from having to replace the tools. Yeah. Alright. Well, since I clearly don't know what's going on right there. <laughs> I guess I need another wall somewhere around here it's hard to know man it's hard to know like typically you would think that they would gather around but I don't have an archer tower I guess we would need this cleared too which we can't do that due to the fact that there's a village here that we don't want to lose we can go past this village I suppose but ah, uh, man it's too hard too hard to know how that would affect us all right, what I am going to do is set in motion one guard tower here, if I can. Actually, it won't even let me because of that tree. Well, there you have it. Just so I don't lose any tools and stuff, should be okay. Now, my farmers, I hope they can really pull out some money today, because I'm going to need it. I should have maybe just maximized one farm. get some grass eating going so we're a little bit faster there we go yeah now they're starting to pull out some money good very good all right catapults very good okay can get this too a couple more archers And two more builders, just to make sure I can man the catapults really quickly. Let's do some more recruiting. <laughs> Gotta keep this up, man. Gotta keep up the pace. Alright, guys. Come on back. Hot food, beautiful women. Y'all know the drill. Uh, what day is it? Okay, it is now day nine. So... We have one more day, one more night to go through before the blood moon. There's the catapults coming. That's good. Farmers should have some money for me. Can actually spend that on um on improving the farms to water mills a little bit further down, I think. I'll take that that gold. Yeah. You guys are doing well. 
You guys are doing well. Not mad at all. All right. So, the wall is... Is the wall secure? Not really, huh? There's no way he's going to make it, but... So this wall is not secure yet. I could send workers out to fix it, but it's not going to be good until the next day, I don't think. We could... We could not worry about that one and bring one of these walls up where there's a tower nearby. If there's a tower nearby here. I don't know if that would be worth it or not, though. I do need to get in front of it somehow. My original strategy is not that, that, that great, unfortunately. Okay, it looks like we already lost our uh, our guy that we recruited. Is there going to be anything to bait? I don't think so. Let's send some workers out here. We'll try to get this fixed up. Day 10. Day of the Blood Moon. Alright. I think... We'll have to make sure that these walls are buffed. Like... All the way. Like the next level of wall. Let's make sure my unemployment is not up through the roof. Because I have done quite a bit of recruiting. And we'll be able to hire sides as well, probably. Let's do two more sides. And use our last two gold on recruiting. Or our last one gold on recruiting, I guess I should say. Two. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> there we go. The forms are going to hold up really, really well for this, by the way. I think they're going to do extremely well. So my builders are going out to kind of hook this form up. And that'll be a second place for my people to hang out. It'd be nice if I could have this, this guard tower as well right here. But I can't expand out for, far enough to do that. Let's let this guy come back on this side of the wall. My next guard tower is going to be here. Let's go ahead and raise this up to at least the first level. That way, something's going to go. We'll, we'll see where they rendezvous. They might just hover back around to that archer tower at night. That's what I'm hoping for, at least. And I do have enough to send an assault out now for the knights as soon as I do get knights. So the morning after the blood moon, we'll have to start recruiting those. Or recruiting with that in mind. Okay, that archer tower is up. We may as well... Uh, bring it up a few more levels after this blood moon. Basically, we just want a rally point. And it is going to be the night of the blood moon. we got to make sure that people are good on the right side here. And again, if I'm making cuts here and there, guys, it's just to show some significant process. Because some of it you've already seen before, especially the very early stages. I would rather include some good action in the videos than uh, than nothing at all, or at least where strategy happens. I don't think I can get there in time. <laughs> I'm gonna test it though. It's only one gold. <laughs> yeah, I do have the archer tower here, so everything's ready to go. Come on, get on this side of the wall. Hurry. Hurry, you can do it. You can do it. Aha, he did it. He did it. What's going on here? Ah, some flyers. Flyers, flyers, flyers. Wow. Ugly. It looks like the horde got us, guys. 
Took a lot of our tools and stuff away. That's horrible. Dang, man. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Well, we lost some money. We gotta get some farmers back in hand. Well, we did survive the Blood Moon, though. And it looks like we're gonna be able to keep most of our people. <laughs> if not all. Let's see. Did we... Yeah, we put a couple gold into that already. We'll just need to refill on some tools and stuff. Which is alright. We survived the Blood Moon. It could have been worse. We'll continue it going. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, give us some dap on that like button to show you support for the series. And you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos, guys. Thanks so much for watching. As always, this is Uljin signing off. And we'll see you next time.